The sum and LCM of two positive integers x and y are given to be 40 and 48. Find the two integers. Brilliant. x and y, sum of these two, x plus y is 40. LCM of x and y is given to be 48. In several of these questions usually start with prime factorization. And 48 prime factorize that. 48 can be written as 12 into 4. 12 is 4 into 3. 4 into 3 into 2 square. Or 2 square into 3 into 2 square. 2 power 4 into 3. In all mathematical, tough, non-routine, unconventional, different questions, usually when you are given HCF, LCM, don't fall back on your long division method. Think in terms of prime factorization. Now I'm going to forget about this question and we'll come to this. I want to think about thinking about the prime factorization of two numbers and then finding the LCM of those. I'm going to forget about 2 and 3. I'm going to think about different primes. Let's say I have one number is 5 square into 7. Another number is 5 into 7 cube. What will be the LCM of these two numbers? I want my number to be a multiple of this. So it should have 5 square and 7. I want my number to be a multiple of this. It should have 5 and 7 cube. Or LCM should be 5 square into 7 cube. Should be 5 square, this should be 7 cube. If we did not have 7 cube, it won't be a multiple of this. If we did not have 5 square, it won't be a multiple of this. HCF. HCF be 5 into 7. 5 into 7 divides this. 5 into 7 divides this. If I had even 5 square, it won't divide this. If I had 7 square, it won't divide this. That's the idea. So LCM and HCF think in terms of prime factorization. Lovely. Now, I want to have two prime factorizations where the LCM is 2 power 4 into 3. Number 1 and number 2. Now, I could have one of the numbers should have a 3. Lovely. I'll put one of the numbers has a 3. It could have other things also. It could have a 3. The other number can also have a 3, but we cannot have a 3 square. Brilliant. This could have a 3, this need not have a 3. One of the numbers should have 2. And so, let's say this number is 2. 2 into 3. Other number has 2, but not 3. 2 cube. Will the LCM be 2 power 4 into 3? Think about it. For these two numbers, the LCM is not 2 power 4 into 3, 2 cube into 3. The highest power of 2 that sits in any of these numbers only 2 cube. So why should my LCM have 2 power 4 in it? Not required. And so, brilliant. Now this gives me a beautiful clue. If I want my LCM to be 2 power 4 into 3, one of the numbers, at least one of the numbers has to have a 3. Simple, otherwise I can't have a 3 here. At least one of the numbers has to have a 2 power 4. If I have 2 and 2 square, the LCM will have only 2 square. If I have 2 square and 2 cube, the LCM will have only 2 cube. The LCM has 2 power 4 in it. That means at least one of the numbers should have 2 power 4 in it. So, one of the numbers has 2 power 4 in it. One of the numbers has a 3 in it. Could be the same number that has both. The other number could have 2 square sitting in it. Definitely one of the numbers has a 2 power 4 in it. What is 2 power 4? 2 power 4 is 2 into 2 into 2 into 2, 16. Or one of the numbers is a multiple of 16. True. And true. Also, one of the numbers is a multiple of 16. Or if I have the two numbers as x and y, one of the numbers could be 16, it could be 32, it could be 48. And then the other number we need to think about. We know that sum of the two numbers is 40. So this is 16. This number should be 40 minus 16. It's 24. If this is 6, 32, it should be 40 minus 32, which is 8. This cannot be 48. That cannot be a negative number. R, we have x and y are 16 and 24, 32 and 8. Now this 32 and 8, wonderful combination. 32 is a multiple of 8. 8 is a factor of 32. LCM of 32 and 8. 32. Not what you are looking at. 
16 and 24, LCM is 48, 16 and 24, add up to 40, get through. Key thing here, the LCM is 48, 48 is 2 power 4 into 3. At least one of the numbers should be a multiple of 3. At least one of the numbers should be a multiple of 2 power 4. 3 is a good starting point, but 2 power 4 is a brilliant starting point. I have one of the two numbers to be a multiple of 16. Either be 16 or 32. It cannot even be 48. I have 16 and remaining, 32 and remaining. 32 and remaining doesn't work. 16 and remaining work. And just to recap, the numbers were 16 and and 24, 16 is 2 power 4, we know, 24 is 2 cube into 3, LCM of these two numbers is 2 power 4 into 3 is 48, that condition is satisfied, we add these two, it is 40, that condition is also satisfied, that's the number we are looking for, x and y are 16 and 24, 16 and 24, 24 and 16, that doesn't matter. Hush.